You know, one of the favorite things on Positive Daily Inspiration over the past year or so has been the Positive Daily quotes. People just love them. They'll copy them, they'll attach them to their emails. And in 2014, we even have some t-shirts that we're bringing out on the Positive Daily quotes that have been popular. One of the most uh, favorite of mine that we have coming, I believe in around March, is a t-shirt that simply has two words on it with quotes. It says, in service. And it's saying that uh, <laughs> what you see on many, many uh, signs ar around the country uh, is that you are in service. And what are you in service for? You're in service to God. Rick Warren has said this, service is the pathway to real significance. And here's where he got that. This is from the Bible, Jesus, Matthew 20, 26 through 28. Whoever wants to be great among you must be your servant. And whoever wants to be first among you must be your slave. Just as the Son of Man did not come to be served, but to serve and to give his life a ransom for many. Jesus taught over and over again that the most esteemed women and men are not the leaders of society or the captains of industry. To the contrary, Jesus said that the greatest among you are those who choose to minister and to serve. Today, you might feel the temptation to build yourself up. We all do. We have this, and I think it's because of our ego or maybe because of our insecurities. We want to build ourselves up in the eyes of those people that we encounter. But if you want to be great in God's estimation, choose instead to serve your neighbors quietly, and without fanfare. Be generous, compassionate, and perhaps even secret in doing so. And then when you have done your best to serve your community and serve your Creator, you can rest in comfort knowing that in the eyes of God you have achieved greatness. After all, God's eyes are the ones that really count. So mark yourself as one of those people lucky enough spiritually to be in service.